gamers. <laughs> hey gamers, we're gonna do some more Goblin Giant Sparky. It's what the people ask for because I say because I'm the people. You're not the people. I won three games in a row this time, mostly because people were playing Wizard e M M Wizard Pekka E Barb's Hog Rider. Like, bro, if you're fighting this in and Tesla, if you're fighting this in. In rank, you should win every time. And for some reason, I kept on fighting against these P.E.K.K.A. Wizard players. This was not the only one. I skelly drags on the Hog Rider to make sure that I only get one hit. I archers on the Wizard. I only played the archers in this game. Because I wanted to try it out and it didn't really work out. I play E Wizards, he plays Minions, I play Arrows, and then I play Skeleton Drags last second, so I only get one swing on the tower. Or the Pekka only gets one swing on the tower. Bada bing bada boom. And now this is where it goes all downhill for him, because now I know everything that he has, and he also wastes his six elixir on countering Skelly Drags. Dude, they're not that, they don't do that much damage. That was a way too much defense. Like, come on. No, uh, I go in for a Goblin Giant because I know I'm like super plus, and I kind of am, and I go in for a Sparky behind it. I go in for the Rage, it counters the Zap pretty much. He does play the E-Barbs on my thing, but I play Archers to... Defend the three crown. Oh. Mm. And then and then he goes hog rider for some reason. I mighty miner in the back. He mirrors hog rider, and then I have skeleton drags and mighty miner going in on the push. So sure, he got half of my tower, but he's also minus nine. Effectively, he wastes his spark or his zap. I rage up my shit. I get mighty miner on tower. I try to use the ability after getting that tower, but I, I failed to do so. I, I archers and then e whiz just so the, the minion horde doesn't kill me. And then he mirrors a hog rider into the e wizard and archers, and it's like, well, what are you doing? I I go goblin giant because I'm just like, well, he just wasted five elixir and a sparky. I think oh, it's, it's lagging right now for some reason. I don't know why it has to lag, but I just it just has to lag. And then he left at a terrible time, and I win. I don't BM him because he was so bad I legitimately think that would be rude. <laughs> then I played this guy with Golem, Fisherman, Skeleton Barrel, like, what are these decks? Like, seriously. What the heck? <laughs> Hopefully it stopped lagging, though. He can't encourage first play, I think. No, he barbed barrels and then he can't encourage. I played the guards on the bar barrel because I honestly I think that's my best first play. I go with Goblin Giant into this because I know the Goblin Giant's going to be able to kill the cannon cart. He goes Golem in the back, which, okay, why? 
So I go skeleton dragons behind the goblin giant to kill the cannon cart. I have it still at my goblin giant still at half HP. He plays way too much on that goblin giant. He plays a goblin cage and a fisherman. And the cage just didn't do anything and the fisherman doesn't do anything either because he skeleton barrels with it, but I have rage. So then I can just perfectly time that rage, like, mm, like, ooh, that was a good rage. And now I have a sparky mighty miner guard push that you can't do anything about. And I get a sparky shot off. He could have played guards, I don't know why he didn't. I think he just wanted me to win at that point. What the, like, what the heck, why didn't you play guards? I go Goblin Giant in the back because it went well for me last time. And then I go Sparky behind it. He goes Goblin Cage. I go Rage. Because I'm starting to realize the value of raising my stuff up. I, I arrows all of that. I don't think the arrows was worth it because the Sparky killed the guards anyways. If I, if I arrowed a bit faster as a prediction, that would have been worth it, but not really. But, but only if that. I go in for a Goblin Giant on this Skeleton Barrel because it honestly cleans it up pretty nice. Uh, I go in for an E with Mighty Miner push, and then Skeleton Drags, too. And then I rage up my Mighty Miner and E with to get the Golem killed, pretty much. I play Guards and Arrows to make sure that I don't get screwed over and skeleton drags and then the goblin giant somewhere hold on nope he played a golem and that's the noise I play a mighty miner with my skeleton drags and you can't defend right right I don't know man it, this game lagging out so much I'm going to hit pause in a second here after this game ends. Hopefully, please. Okay, never mind. It's done lagging. I rage up my skeleton drags and my, and my one rage skeleton drag takes the tower. And he couldn't even get in the push. He couldn't even get the skeleton barrel to land while well, alone well, it to do the tower. Now I'm playing against this guy with arrows, fireball, log. This dude is out here trying to counter me. But it doesn't work. He plays a Valk in the back for his first play. So I Mighty Miner in the back because you know that's just what you do. Then he Teslas, and I'm like, that's just like a really big way, so I mean, Sparky in the back. And then, he, and then he Hog Riders, so then I guards on the Hog Rider, obviously. He arrows at the worst possible time, com almost being a complete waste, so I'm just like, fuck it, let me go in for the Goblin Giant. I rage up my stuff. And it does pretty good. Damage to tower and damage to the P.E.K.K.A. One, only half of the spear goblins were focusing on the P.E.K.K.A. So I got good tower damage. He P.E.K.K.A.s and then wishes it behind it. But I E with. He fireballs. And then that gives me enough time to guards. Guard, you're a pretty good answer to Witch, honestly, once they're on your, your side. 
I would have logged that, honestly, but I guess he didn't want to. Does he even use the log this game? I forget. Oh, oh yeah, he does. He just to cycle it. I goblin giant in the wrong lane, so I have to use Mighty Miner's ability if I wanted to add to my counter push. And I do. He witches, so I have skeleton drags to get rid of the Tesla. He fireballs. I rage to try to kill the witch, and I and I kind of succeed. I, I decide to just arrows just to be safe, and it forced out another. It forced out the log, even though it shouldn't have forced out the log because I was going to take tower anyways. He Valkyrie hog riders, so I just sparky that. Sure, it takes a lot of damage, but that tower was already pretty much down anyways. So then I go in for a Goblin Giant, and then it lags out again. God. I swear the video's almost over. The video's almost over. The video's almost over. I get the Mighty Miner to tank for the Tesla. I, I arrows everything and then rage everything and then Mighty Miner takes tower. Or he logs, but that's... I freak... Oh, come on. Come on, stop lagging out so much. There's no reason to lag like this. I'm going to title this video The Lag. Oh my god. Because I can't. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 8, 7. There we go. Okay. A couple of hiccups today, I suppose, but. Yeah, it goes to sudden death, I forgot. It's, I skeleton drags on this, and I think that's enough. It gets me a big positive four, plus four elixir trade. I go in for the Goblin Giant, the Guards, and the Sparky. I E Wizard, predicting a Tesla that didn't happen, and I get the tower with my Goblin Giant Guards push. Bada bing, bada boom, off. And then I emote, but the game doesn't show it because the game is lagging. Bro, bro why does it have to lag so much? Oh, uh, I'm, I'm still uploading this. This was mostly clean when it came to the recording once I get to actually do that do 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 gonna just lay there we go